Dear customer, there's been an unexpected delay in the shipment of your order from Amazon. Please click here to retrieve important information. When did I make a order? Hey, mom. Hey, Rachel, I just got this email from Amazon about an order that I placed last week. Did I order something for you? Mom, the last time I remember you ordering was a couple months ago. Hmm, well, this email says there's been a delay in shipping my order, but it doesn't say what it is. Oh, it's telling me to click this link for detailed shipment information. Whoa, wait a minute, don't click anything yet. If you don't recognize the order, that could be a fish email. What kind of fish? A fish email, like not a fish with an F, but a fish with a PH. It's basically a fake email hackers use to get your personal information, like your usernames, passwords, and even your credit card numbers. Oh, well, I get so many emails every day, and I do order from Amazon. How do you know if this one is fake or not? There's a few things that can tip you off to that. First, look at the email address it's from. Is it from Amazon.com? Oh, wait. Amazon's actually spelled wrong. It's A-N-A-Z-A-N.com. What the heck? Oh, nah, that's not right. Man, I should have noticed that. It could be easy to overlook, especially if it's a site you regularly order from. Anyway, now hover the mouse over the link they want you to click. The web address it takes you to should show up. Oh, wow. What? Yeah, it shows some long website that's clearly not Amazon, and actually it's nothing I ever even heard of before. Yeah, that really sounds suspicious, but check one more thing. Okay. What? Is it addressed to you specifically? Like, does it use your name in the email? No, it just says, dear customer. See, that's another red flag. If it were really from Amazon or another company you've ordered from, it would probably use your real name, even your full name. Yeah, you know, you're right. I thought it sounded just kind of generic. I'm just gonna go ahead and delete this email. Yep, definitely delete it. Well, I'm glad I called you, honey. Thanks for your help. No problem, Mom. What in the world would you do without me? Oh, I don't know, throw raging parties, Travel around the world. Oh, buy myself a pony. Okay, bye mom. Have all my money to myself, move to Hawaii. I'm hanging up now. Just because you get an email that looks like it may have been from a company you ordered from before doesn't automatically make it legitimate. And never click on any links included in any suspicious emails. You may be opening yourself up to hackers that just want to access your personal information in your email account. Your best bet is to delete any unfamiliar emails from your inbox and your trash.